So, today I have some exciting news for anyone waiting on the Steam Deck. The other day Valve announced a release date for the device, and I'm excited to say that it is extremely soon. So let's talk about it in today's video, right now, on the Linux Lounge. So first, the reason that you probably clicked on this video. I'm excited to say that the Steam Deck is going to be released on the 25th of February this year, which isn't even a month away, which is extremely exciting. And although the device was initially planned to be released at the end of 2021, a delay of an extra few months isn't bad at all considering just how revolutionary this product is. During this month leading up to the launch of the Steam Deck, Valve is apparently going to be working hard to tie up the last few loose ends and polish some rough edges, which may or may not relate to the shipping of the device. Additionally, Valve is still working to get as many Windows games as possible working on the device using Proton. So by the time that you get this device, not only will you have a huge library of native Linux games available to you, but you'll also have a variety of games that will be capable of running through Proton on day one. Hopefully the huge library of games, including a lot of Windows titles, will be something that pushes people to buy this device. Now, as this is a mostly free software device, it's also going to be the case that there will be constant improvements to the Steam Deck. For instance, this Friday there will be a major release of Wine, which adds a plethora of new features that will benefit the Steam Deck, and presumably that sort of thing will continue for years to come. And I have to say, that's the major advantage of devices that run free software. They get better as time goes on, not worse like devices that run proprietary software. So, I'm sure if you've pre-ordered a Steam Deck, you might be wondering when you're going to get your device. Well, if you pre-ordered it early on, you'll probably get it sometime after mid-March. But if you've pre-ordered it a bit later on, then there probably will be a bit of a longer wait. But I have to say, it seems like Valve are getting these devices into gamers' hands impressively quickly. So, to finish off this video, I want to ask myself, will I be getting a Steam Deck? Well, probably not, honestly. I still do most of my portable gaming on a hacked PS Vita, and to be honest, as far as I'm concerned, that is the best gaming device in the world for my use case, so I don't see any reason to upgrade it really. But, I am still excited to see what the Steam Deck is capable of, and maybe at some point in the future if I can grab a used one at a reasonable price, I might very well go for it. But with that said, that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed watching it, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.